Welcome to another video on my drone robot Discovery made of Visio Technique and based on the uh, TXT controller which runs embedded Linux um, accessible via USB, uh, Wi-Fi, uh, Bluetooth um, but in my case I use Wi-Fi um, programming in a Python and using um, two front sensors, active sonar, and the USB camera. Also, um, uh, a light which, in normal circumstances, um, indicates a change in behavior. And the motor is propeller. Also, in normal circumstances, to indicate if the algorithm is still running. And these are not normal circumstances because since recently I have uh, problems accessing the whole controller. Firmware uh, doesn't matter seemingly, but I'm going to find out again. Another attempt. So can I access the controller? I hope so. Let's find out. So, as I mentioned, uh, firmware doesn't matter in this case. So uh, I have ejected the SD card, the micro SD card, which is located here. Um, the micro SD card contains the community firmware. So now I will be starting the standard firmware. This way I can things see a little better. Hopefully it boots normally. And let me in the, in the meantime start Robo Pro, very useful. Yes. I'm using Fedora Linux. Uh, Robo Pro is a Windows program, so I'm using Wine as well. Wine is not an emulator. And in the meantime, it has started, which is good. And this is Robo Pro, also good. Um, now I have to set. Uh, this is good, I think. Yeah, 133. And. The idea is that I will um, access it using RoboPro. So this should be the address that I uh, have to use. Will it work? I don't know yet. So for this, I am going to access the menu. And let me see if this is working out. So, accessing settings, security, and SSH and VNC are active, which is good. That means that I should be able to access it. But this is not activated yet. Oh, really? I have to give a uh, uh, root po uh, password, so I'll do that offline. And by offline, I mean, of course, off camera, which has happened and now it is connected. So that would be good. The question is, does everything work the way I want? This should be working as well. One sixty eight, eight, two, connect. Yes, that does work. That's good. Very good, even.
The question is now, does this work? No, because there's a comma here. No certification field. Okay, that is no problem. Oh wait, I made a mistake here. Because this is not the address I'm using, I'm using this address. And I have to change this one. Yes. Password. And I'm in. So, why am I succeeding now and not succeeding on other one, uh, on the other? Um, that is a very big problem. Um, the last time I've tried this with um, the other robot, uh, walking robot Mirft 2, um, it didn't want to connect at all. SSH did not respond. So now I have very good access. And I have to set the speed rather low. Okay, this is good, I think. So let me see if this works out. Uh, move the camera a little bit backwards. Yeah, definitely. And it rolls off the table. Um, then, same speed. A different motor. Oh, now I know why it doesn't work. Because for some reason, battery is gone off. Let me see if I can uh, boot it again. If not, I'll have to replace the battery. It still boots. Okay. But I have lost this uh, connection. So I have to do it over. Alright, after the power down uh, and switching on, I had to wait um, a few minutes to get access again. So let's see if this happens once again. And I do get access. Yes. Um, unfortunately also I have to set this again. And everything is erased. And that is a uh, uh, too bad. On the um, using the community firmware, I can scroll back and uh, getting all the old commands. Here, I obviously cannot. Um, can I set the command? Oh, of course, this one has. This one has reset, obviously. Connect, and there it is, again. Okay, so, um, first focus, uh, can I get access? Yes, I can, obviously. Then, um, the, um, the load of the battery pack, uh, 86, 8,6 volts, which is enough. It gets wrong when it gets around 80. So why did it shut down? Probably the wiring. Can I run a program? Um, on this one, I am not quite sure. 
because everything I had was, uh, was experiment on the um, on the walking robot, not here. Um, that is to say, yeah, this is empty. I can use Scratch, but I didn't use it. Scratch is not a programming language, by the way. Oh, C program. Um, oh, that's interesting. Empty. Okay. Empty. Sound files will not be empty. Yep, that's all of them. And in my old, in my previous videos, you can hear quite a lot of those. But main thing is, I have regained access to this one. Does this also mean that I can get access back to the uh, community firmware? Let me check that one. Okay, so now I put it into the community firmware. I had to set uh, SSH and VNC active. So I have now to change back to um, this IP address. Will I get access? Um, I'm not quite sure yet, so let me prepare this one in the meantime. Now it is going to be exciting. Will it take my password? No. I may have made a typing mistake. Oh wait. I did make a typing mistake. It's refusing. Very unfortunate. Which also means I probably won't get access here. Could not connect to the interface. All right. Um, because I do want to do something. Um, this has no use because this is only uh, usable from uh, the community firmware sending photos but since that's not happening um, I better revert to the other firmware unfortunately okay back into the standard firmware it has taken quite a while uh, for uh, reconnection so let's see if this still works. And yes, that still works. This works as well. What is the battery voltage? 8.4. Okay. No problem there. At this time. Um, yes, it drives. Um, Sonar, um, which is here, I think. Yeah. Um, th this camera is, of course, on the tripod. And it is at 5 centimeters from the sonar. So that is quite understandable. So if I move it, you can see the distance getting larger, which is quite no, uh, if I move it closer, it gets unreliable unless I move it aside, and you can see why. Because um, in here it doesn't see it, and then it sees other things like some uh, 
leg of the tripod that is indeed 11 centimeters away. Why do I say centimeters? Uh, quite simply, um, this program uses metrics. As do I, by the way. Uh, in the Netherlands, where I'm located, uh, we use metrics, not in parallel, like feet and inch. Anyway, this works nicely. Um, this as well, and that one as well. Yeah, very good. So, no problem here, so I can't test it. But the whole thing was can I um, access it? Yes, and the other one is no. And that's what I'm. Uh, wanted to show. And that's it for this time. Um, successful on one hand, not successful on the other hand. And by the way, uh, that is a fish technique camera um, with a fish technique um, supporting. And that is the tripod. And the same camera, but then um, for imaging, which doesn't work because there's no program on it right now. Um, thanks for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and give the video a thumbs up. Please leave a comment or suggestion. Very much appreciated. You can follow me via Instagram and Twitter as well. Um, with Instagram TV reactivated. Um, please support by uh, becoming a patron or via PayPal wi uh, Wired, which is IBAN, not Wired, IBAN. Um, this is going to be continued in some way. Um, so, please stay safe. Uh, take care. Bye-bye.